Hello my darlings. Happy Thursday to all of you and welcome back to Let's Build the Worlds. And welcome to part four of the pink house. We are into the interiors today. Now this has got a little had a got a little now this has gone and had a little bit of a facelift. I was just not enjoying how the build was looking. It was just looking a little bit weird and it just needed tweaking in a few places. I'm looking at it now. You can probably see it on my glasses. Right there, look, darlings. Um, it was just looking cartoony. There was, I was just not vibing with it. Something was off. Um, and it was a few things. It was a few things that were just off to me. So I got rid of them. I got rid of them and it's looking a lot better. It really is. So today, what we're going to do, we're going to do the living room and maybe make a start on the kitchen as well today. So living room, kitchen and downstairs, they're quite big rooms, actually. Um, so I don't think I'll get them finished today, but we'll at least get them bloody started, my loves. That is what's going to happen. Um, and then tomorrow, obviously, what I've got coming is a speed build. Next week, we've got more Let's Build the Worlds, obviously. And also some Design Me Devon is coming next week as well. Um, that is what is happening on the channel next week. Yes, it is. Anyway, I've waffled on enough. Let's get over into game and start building. Right then, my little darling buggers. Here we are, we're back. Look. Much better, hey? Something's missing there because I've just noticed it and it made me absolutely fuming. Um, and it's this. We need to flop this back in and I'll show you around properly, my darlings. There we go. Beautiful. Um, I got rid of those windows. I got rid of those windows. I got rid of that pergola. I moved the chimney over to this area here. It was, it then gave us enough room to be able to put these back in, in a nice spot where the Sims will be able to get in and use them quite easily. Um, changed off, yep, as I said, the windows. Those windows were just not working on this build. They really weren't, as much as I was trying to make them work, it just wasn't happening. Put a little fence, a little gate here as well, so they've got access out onto the beach area. Um, and that's about it, really. That's what I did, but those tweaks, and also the interior as well, I've tweaked the interior colors and stuff the colors were just not for me they really weren't um so that's what i've done that's what i've done and i'm for it and i also got rid of the um the wisteria as well it was just it just looked too swamped this build did and i like it now i actually am a-okay with it now uh I, I put a half wall here as well just to like sort of like hide this area a little bit a little a little bit of privacy on that sort of section and i tried it like around here as well a bit of half wall but it just didn't look right um so i'm gonna keep this fence all the way along here and i'm happy with it now i'm finally happy with this build it's taken a while to win me over but it's winning me over now darlings yes it has so what we're doing we're going to be doing this living room area here and the kitchen today i think we're going to start on the kitchen for a bit of a change I think we're going to start on the kitchen. This is obviously going to be the pantry, but I'm thinking about moving that to there. So we've got enough space here to put some more units and stuff down, like counter space. Counter space here as well. So it's going to be a bit of a broken up kitchen with maybe a little bit of an island here. I don't know because we've got a fireplace there. I don't know what we're going to do. Um, and I don't know what kitchen we're going to use either. Um, we're going to go for some brighter colored furniture and stuff and pieces in here just to splash of color here and there no idea on color things at all yet but i do want this place to look kind of semi-modern still little aspects here in it like the original um georgian tiles in the um the foyer <laughs> aiden it's just the entrance um and yeah that's where we're gonna go today yes we are indeed and i do need to bring that a little bit further along as well so we have got enough space here to put some counters there too is that going to make that weird though it might make it a bit semi-weird so what i'm going to do is flop you to there whiffle you around like that my love so you open inwards and then we've got a nice little bit of spaceage going on there yeah <clears throat> yeah i'm fine with that absolutely fine with it so let's crack on uh i'm going to pick a kitchen first and we're going to start trying to place the kitchen around see where what kind of layout we can come up with um good luck to me Right, I think this kitchen would look lovely in here. This is the island living kitchen. Is it the island living kitchen? Is it Salvador Adin? It's the... Where are we? The jungle adventure ki kitchen, sorry. I always say I get these two mixed up all the time and I don't know why because they're completely different. Um, I just like the tones in here. I think that would really work. Now, I'm going to test this layout with you lot because I don't know if this is going to work or not, but we're going to make it... We're going to try. The fridge is going in here. The oven's going there. So I'm thinking sink here. And then I'm going to do like an island against the wall there. I think that's what we're going to try and get across here. 
Um, so let's see if we can do that, shall we? <laughs> let's see if this is going to work. Because this is going to be a bit of a, a fiddly layout, I think. Um, yes. Yes, that's fine. Yes. Yes, we'll carry on. I'm going to probably put the sink maybe like here. Hmm. Yes. And I think what I'm going to have to do is I might have to do counters on one side and then an island on the other side. I think that is what we're going to have to try and portray. Now, I don't want it too big. So maybe like one there. Um, and maybe I could then go in with an end piece here, like here. Let me see. Is that the right end piece, what I want there? Oh, it should be. But it looked weird then for some reason. Maybe I should do a corner piece. Oh, that's better. Yes. Something like that. And then we're going to see if we can match in um, a counter on the other side like these. Oh, God. Here we go. <laughs> this is going to be a bitch. I can feel it in my um, um, tuppence. <laughs> I don't know what I was going to say then. I think I was going to say vagina. And I do not have one of them. Do not have one of them. And after all the jip it gives you people out there with, with your vajayjays, um, I don't want one either. Because my friends all suffer. And all suffer from their monthly visit from Miss Flo. And that is not for me. <laughs> yeah, I think this might work. There is a slight little bit of glitching going on there. But what I think I'm off might try and do is maybe i mean i don't mind this overhang that's going to be absolutely fine i do not mind that at all but uh, almost makes me let me see if i can fit in a corner piece of this and see what that would do um i think this might not work but we're gonna try it we're gonna try it does that look weird oh no that's okay still glitching though still glitching but i can bring this down to this level now so we're all gonna get a bit, a bit more of an overhang I mean, I don't, it's that corner piece there, though. What's that about? Let me have a little play around. There we go. <laughs> Nothing was working. So I'm going to use, I'm going to use this barstool table, which is from university, I think, is it? Is this from university? Where are you from? Little John's big table. Yeah, university. I think that goes nicely with the kitchen as well, then. And then we can still keep that lovely counter moment that we've got going on here, which I like. I do. Thinking about putting the um, sink here, though, to be honest. So they've got like a little view of the sea while they're washing the dishes. Mm, I might do that and have this as like a... Um, uh, like appliance sort of like area. Yeah, I think we'll do that. I think we will. So I need to pick some bar stools. So let's have a look together. So we've gone for like kind of a natural vibe now. I wouldn't mind getting a little bit of blue in this room, to be honest. Um, that wood's a little bit too dark on that one what about do you come in anything that's oh oh that's not too bad let me see you let me see let me see a little little pop of blue bluey gray i mean it's more gray than blue to be honest little pop of yellow i think we're gonna go for a little pop of yellow in here i like that yeah nice little pop of yellow unsure about this light in here just yet i'm gonna carry on with the kitchen um i'm thinking about doing some like spotlights um over this area here I think I might do that. Right, so we need an industrialish, which is the word for today. An industrialish um, sink going on that part there. Yeah, the sink looks cool there. I do like that. Okay, right, we've got an oven here. I might actually go and use that big uh, extractor fan with the light on up here. Because I don't really use this in a whole lot. But I might actually use it in this room. Let me see. Yeah, I think I might. I think I might. Now, did, is this the one that didn't come with cupboards? Oh, no, it did come with cupboards. Well, slap me on the tits, my loves. I did not expect that. Did not expect that. Thank you very much for, for doing some cupboards. <laughs> and not thinking, that's too much work. That's too much work. We're not going to put some cupboards in here. Because <laughs> we know that happens, doesn't it? I forgot how to flip this around. Someone told me how to do it once, and I've always, I just keep forgetting how to do it. Um, how do I do that? <laughs> you wouldn't think I'm a builder, would you? Just like, how do I do that again? I forgot the alt. No. Okay. What about this one? It all, it was, oh, oh, I did it. I did it. I did it. I, am I doing it? Who am I? What? What? 
That's not gonna work. <laughs> we'll forget. We'll forget we tried that. Oh no, no. I was gonna use that there, but I think we should put these here as well. Um, they need to come down a bit. They do. I think they're up a little bit too high. Let's bring these down a smidge. Let's have a look. Is that too low now? No idea. No idea. Absolutely no idea. But we're gonna carry on. We're gonna carry on. Where's this? Where did the, I just I dropped that. Where did that go? Right, this one. And then a smaller one up here. Beautiful. I hate when they look different colours. I assure you that they are, they are the same colours. It's just the Sims being the Sims. Um, I don't like these along here now for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe we should do shelves there. Oh, that's a good idea. Let's do shelves on this side. Against the wall as well. That would be nice. Yes. Oh, yes. Right. Um, and I think this, oh, that's a bit yellowy, that one. Need to go a little bit more natural. There we are. Um, this one, or maybe the snowy escape one. I've got a feeling the snowy escape one might be a bit too warm, though, for it. Yeah, I think it's a little bit too warm for in here, sadly. Um, not too classic. I do want this kitchen to look like it's gone through a bit of a revamp, a bit of a reno over the years. So I'm going to keep it. Um, a little bit more of a clean line, modern vibe, you know? Yeah, I think so. Unless I colour the... Unless I do grey ones here against the wall. Oh, they don't do grey. Or white. Let me see white. Oh, white's quite nice. Yeah, I prefer the white. We're going to sort the lighting out over here. Look, at, look, every single one of these shelves looks like a completely different colour to each other. <sighs> My lord. My lordy, lordy, low. Right, we're going to do a couple of spotlights here. One there. Oh, God, this might be a bit bright. I might turn them down, actually. One there, one there. Let me see that. Yeah, that's going to be a bit too too bright and a bit too cool. Um, Let me flop these along here. And then I'm going to... Oh, what am I doing? I'm getting the tool mod out. I don't need you. Shift and place that. If you're wondering how I'm doing this... Um, it's the Better Build and Buy mod that allows you to change the lighting in build mode. Why is that not in game? That's what I would like to know. Yeah. Yeah, but I think we should do tiles back here now I've got this on. So I'm going to do some tiles back here. And guess what tiles I'm going to use? You've guessed it right. The subways. Because I love them. Because I love them. And so does this family. Thank you. Thank you for coming. Yeah. Yeah, that's nicer. That just brings a bit more of a kitcheny edge in. <laughs> kitcheny edge. Right, I want some lights. I want to find some lights. So let me have a little look around. Gone for these ones. Those nice little salmony pink colours. I just think it suits the colour of like the cupboards. And it goes nice with the yellow as well. I've also changed out the fire. The fireplace was just looking a bit weird in here. I still wanted it to have some kind of fire. So I've gone for... um this uh, um, log burner <laughs> set. My brain is still not there, loves. It's really not. It's absolutely more than it was before. It's absolutely gone. And we're just going to have to deal with it for the next coming weeks. Dread to think what my vlog's going to turn out like next weekend. <laughs> my brain, my brain's still having a fart. It really is having a big old guff. And um. <laughs> Not a big old guff, Adrian, for goodness sake. Uh, <laughs> but it is. It very much is. I'm also going to change out that span drawer as well. Maybe just put a nice white one in. Let me see that. Yeah, that's better. We'll do that. Um, I was going to get rid of that little black line there, but I'm kind of feeling it now. So I'm going to leave it. I'm going to absolutely leave it in. And what we're going to do now is flop a little bit of a grey brick moment there as well, I think. Uh, unless I do that. No. Oh, I don't know. Oh, I quite like that, actually. Yeah, we'll do that. Tell him. Yeah, that's cute. I like that. I do. So, I'm kind of happy with how this layout is. I thought we were going to struggle a lot more in here, and it's left me with so much more room, and I hate the fact that that wall is so overexposed. Can we not? No, we're just going to stay that way, okay? Okay. Okie dokie. Okie dokie dokie. It might sort itself out when we come back um, go out game and come back in again. But if it doesn't, I'll try and sort something. Right. So we need a fridge. We need a fridge. Don't worry. You probably all thought, where are you putting the fridge? 
Little did you know, darling, we've got a utility closet in here, sweetheart. We're going to be flopping one of these in here. We're going to go for a modern fridge. I am going to do a um, washer and dryer in here as well, actually. So where is it? Where are you again? You're in appliances. Appliances. And then you are in the misc section, aren't you, darling? And I'm just going to flop a nice white one in here without the coin slots, please. Thank you. Um, there we go. But why is the lighting so shit in here as well, you know? It's got a full spotlight in here. I do not understand. Oh, look at that wall. Look at look. Just look at it. Do I need to, like, redraw you back in again? For you to stop being an absolute bellend? Yes, that's what I needed to do. Make make this game make sense. Please, somebody. And look at the colour of my washing machine and dryer now. Slap a pitch time, I think. <laughs> oh, my Lord. Right, we'll just leave that as it is because I'll just get angry and end up causing a stink. Right. Okay. Right. I think we need to pull out a few more bits in here. Um, I'm unsure of what... This looks a bit high to me. This looks a little bit too high. I'm going to move you down. Um, I don't even need to do the other side because you can't see it because it's covered in ivy. Um, so I'm not going <laughs> to... Uh, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to make more work for myself when it's absolutely unnecessary. Unless you ripped that ivy off, you would notice that they are a lot higher. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah, but... Oh, great. Love when it does that as well. Nice to see that bug still in the game as well. Thank you. Thank you for coming. I'm going to put this window in here as well. I'm going to put this window... Is that at that right height? It is. Um, I can see you. Don't think I can't. Uh, oh, and there's a spotlight out there as well. I bet someone saw that. Right. And then we'll come down to that level, my love. And flop this in. I think this might be a bit of a, a kitchen renovation today. We might make a start. We'll make a start on the living room. But I don't think we'll get it finished today. But we'll make a little start. See what we come up with, you know. Um, But we seem to have gone for a bit more of a pastel-y vibe in here. So I'm... I might even go for a, a classy pastel vibe in this house. Um, just bringing little pots of colour that way. I hate how overexposed this is. I don't know why it's doing that. Do I need to take away one of these lights and then rethink? I mean, that's sorted out slightly, but it's still got that horrible light up there. Look, at, look. I know I keep complaining, but I'm just fed up. I've reached my limit. How badly this game works sometimes. <laughs> and I think it's good to voice your opinion, especially if it's something you love. It very much is. So don't ever feel ashamed that you're voicing your opinion. There is a correct way to do it, though. And that is just by menial bitching like me. Thank you. I'm never horrible. I'm never nasty to, exact, to individuals. Like I've seen people being out there in the community. Um, like... You know, have some decorum, for goodness sake. Right. <clears throat> yes. Right. As I said, what I was going to do, I'm going to pull out a few more bits for this room that I just think would work in here. So give me two secs. Details have been added in. Um, I put some spices up here. Very important for this family. They love their cooking and they love their spicy cuisines. Um, some freshly grown herbs over there as well. I've put some lovely little um, pieces up on here just to sort of like fill those shelves up nicely. All the appliances throughout the coffee, the microwave. I've got a cookbook with all of their family recipes and stuff in. Um, and I've also done this area a little bit around here as well. Cat bowl. We are going to be putting a cat with this family. Definitely. Um, um, nice little side table here. Little plant coming on here. Little moment we've got going on there as well with that. And I just put down a nice little oil candle. Um, and I like it. I like how this living room has came out. I need to do some more details around this area here. But I don't know what we're going to do with that yet. I think what we're going to do now, though, is start off, start on the living room area. Now, this is going to be a bit of a weird layout because of how the shape of this room. So I'm thinking dining table is going to have to go over to this area. So the living room needs to be around kind of like this area here, kind of centralized around the fireplace. Um, dining table wise, I don't really know. I'm thinking probably going for this kind of vibe that we did with this, like that 
kind of, does that one come in a, a table version of that as well? I can't remember. I can't remember if it was only like a, a bar stool one or we actually had a table version as well. Let's, let's find out together. No, it didn't. Oh, well, it came with this one. Uh, no, that's not the vibe I want in here. Not the vibe. Something definitely robust. Oh, maybe actually. The one that Sam or um, Harry did. Oh, we could use the new one with the little table runner. Oh, that would look smashing in here. Oh, yes. Yes. <laughs> yes, indeed. Yeah, we're going to do this. Yeah, that would look lovely in here. Okay, and I think I'm going to use the new chairs now that I've used that one. I have used this um, table and chairs in my new speed build that's coming tomorrow. Oh, actually. Ooh. That kind of keeps it a little bit more coastal. Let me just see the new chairs with this and see if see which one we want to use. Where are you? I can't see you for the life of me. Um, oh, here they are. And the other one's down here, weirdly. Oh, there you are. Oh, this one would look nice as well, though. Oh. Oh, they do both look nice. Oh, that one looks a little bit more coastal to me. Yeah, we're going to use the new ones. Just because of the wicker moment on the back, I think we're going to use these. Let's do a nice big family table. And I'll have to put in a toddler chair as well. <sighs> I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> I'm not joking. Um, <clears throat> no, let's put a toddler chair in. <laughs> if we must, you know, even though they're all disgusting. Um, what? Can we? Where's that other like chair? The toddler one? Yeah, we'll go for this one. That kind of whiter, sort of more modern looking version. I think we'll do that. I think we could. Oh, I don't know, actually, because I don't know how much we're going to come out here with the sofa. This is going to be hard to do here. <clears throat> I'm thinking what I might need to do is we might need to do a cheeky... Let me see what height this half wall is. No, it needs to be higher than that. Like there, maybe? Is that a bit high? Like this. Here. Is that a little bit too low? I think that might be a little bit too low now. Um, A little half wall here. And then what I'm going to do is... Um, maybe have like a little nook here, a little bookshelf or something in there. I'm going to put a pillar on this as well. I'm going to use the same pillars as what we've been using in this house, just so it kind of blends in. Uh, I would prefer if that was in white, to be honest, I think. I don't know. Oh, no, because it's going to reflect that grey over that side. Right, that should be okay. You don't need to be here for the minute. You can go out there, but I might need you again, so you have to stay. Um... I'm going to change the colour of this water and you're going to have to excuse the lighting in here until we've sorted it out. Yes. <clears throat> Lovely. And then what that does, that gives us enough, a bit more space there to be able to put a sofa. So I'm going to put like a two-seater here or maybe, oh, I might have to like move this around and flop you onto the other edge of that wall there. And that doesn't matter because it kind of reflects on what we've done on this side. Um, which is nice. And then that will give us enough, enough more room there to be able to put a sofa in. Now, I need to find sofas that's going to match in with this room, okay? And I do want to pop a bit of colour in here. So I may even reflect on bringing a bit of yellow into this room. Or maybe even a bit of pink. So let me have a look for a good sofa. Ooh, I like it. The one from the Dream Home Decorator. The modular one. I think that's going to be a nice little vibe in here. Yes. Yes, I do like that. Yeah, I like that. I like that. I like that a lot. Right, we're going to put this to here. I think we are going to keep this light in this room. Yeah, it's just... An, in fact, what I'm going to do is put two of these in. I'm going to do one here. And then I'm going to put one over the um, dining area. I do need to bring another colour into this room. And I'm thinking either like a blue... Like a nice powdery blue colour or even a pink. I could pop a bit of pink in here as well. The lighting is just all over the show in this room. Look, like, well, why? Why are you like that? There. Hmm? Oh, my loves. My loves. It's a constant battle sometimes. It really is. It's a constant battle. Um, I'm thinking I'm going to put some debug lighting in. <clears throat> I'm going to put some debug lighting in. So let me do that. Let's go into debug. 
Oh, but nothing was just working then. Nothing was working. I've put a sconce here to help out with the lighting back here. I just really hated the half wall behind this. So I'm keeping this this way. And I'm thinking, why don't you have this as like a little toddler area nook? That's what I'm thinking. So maybe putting down like some a toy box and stuff like that behind here. I think that could be quite cute. Or even like a little um, dollhouse as well. Like a little dollhouse, a little, little toddler nook behind the sofa. Did anybody else as a kid always play behind the sofa? I did. Story time. I actually went missing once for five hours. Um, before I've, I'm sure I've told this on stream, on um, stream, on video before, but I went missing once for five hours and my mum had the whole neighbourhood out looking for me. Um, and I was about five, I was about five years old. Literally, my mum turned about for one minute and I was, Joe, <laughs> see you later. I'm gone. Um, do you want to put shelves up there? Um, don't know. Don't know what we want to do up there just yet. Um, and it turned out that I'd managed to get into my mum's next door neighbour's house. And I was behind the sofa playing with Lego. <laughs> Can you imagine how fuming you would be as a parent? Five hours behind the sofa playing with Lego. <laughs> little shit what a little shit oh i just pulled this out on a whim but this actually goes really nicely in this room yeah i do like that yeah yeah we'll do that we'll do that there i'll put this bookshelf here i'm unsure about that to be honest i'm gonna take that away we're definitely not gonna finish this room today but um we've, we've made a nice start with it i think i think we've made a nice start I'm not in love with it just yet, but I think we will be by the time that we finish. The kitchen's nice. I do like the kitchen. The lighting's throwing me off everywhere, though. It's just really pissing me off because it's made all these cupboards look weird. But that's just me being a perfectionist. And the sim's not working properly. Um, But, yeah, I think we're done for today. I think we're done for today. We'll come back with this next week. Um, And la next week will be the last week with this build. We'll make sure to get this finished next week. Because we are moving, my loves. Somewhere in particular. I mean, I'm not trying to hint to you or anything where we're going to be building and what we're going to be doing. But, um, you know, just going to leave that there. Just as a little hint. Not too much of a hint, but just like enough of a hint. <laughs> Definitely want to get over to the island and I want to start on the build and the... The array of people that I've got in mind for this place. This place is going to be a bit of fun to build this. It really is. Um, and the next vlog is going to help with that immensely. That's all I'm going to say as well. Because I've got ideas. Left. Anyway, I'm going to leave you on the screen as well today. What a lovely screen to leave on. Look at us like, out at sea. Out at sea. And you guys there watching me like a fisherman's wife. I have no idea what I'm saying. Anyway, I'm going to leave you now. I'm live on Twitch tonight at 7pm playing a horror game we didn't get a chance to play it yesterday because um it started to update when i was bloody streaming and i couldn't update it on time so we are starting that tonight so if you do want to come along 7 p.m but if not i will be back with you guys tomorrow with a speed build and i'll see you then